Alright, here we go. Fix your start on these rockers. Got my undercoating on here. Protect it from rust in the future. Uh, went on and did the back side of the rocker too, all the way down. I drilled my uh, drilled the holes so I could weld it all the way around. And uh, what I'll do here, I'm gonna go ahead and line this on up close as I can get it, and go ahead and uh, mark these in here so I can kind of. Uh, grind these down so I can get a better bite on the weld. And uh, go ahead and put my door up. After I get this side kind of welded in a little bit, I'll go ahead and put my door up here and adjust the rock rim from there. I'll probably get my fender right here too so I can look at this end and go from there. Alright, let's see what happens. Alright, got the door set, got the gap looking pretty good around there, pretty close from what I originally had it when I took it off, all the lines are lining pretty close. So what I'm going to do now, slide this rock right in here, kind of tight around this door. place for now check my gap right in here and kind of line up with the rocker here I'm gonna uh, the original one I took off was lined up with this so so I'm gonna try to you know see if I can keep it close as it was so and keep the gap right here then on this side I really need to get my fender out here first because it comes on down and lines up and we'll look at that after I get the fender up. I'm gonna go and put a few spot welds on this side Get this all lined up. Here we go. All right, here's what I'm trying to do. I got the rocker in place. I'm trying to line it up with this original uh, cap corner on the bottom and the side. Plus, keep my same line up on the door when I shut the door. So I just got to kind of knock this around here a little bit. Let's see if I can do this. Let's see, can you see that right there? Right here. So I gotta bring it down a little bit, keep this lined up. Maybe knock that in a little bit right there. Now I'm doing all, all this off this original cab corner that I didn't cut it out. I'd have been really messed up if I would have. I'd have still plated it in somehow. But I gotta keep my gap right in here. Pretty much the same. I mean, we're not looking bad right in there from what it looked like when I tore it apart. Everything's still looking pretty close. Then I'll uh, go ahead and spot weld this in a few spots here and there. And uh, then I'll fight the front one in. But I think I'm going to go ahead and tack this on up real quick and check it out. I already got this side tacked in. Looking pretty good. Gap's looking good. Just got a few tacks in it for now. A couple of tacks. Got to do a little surgery here. But that's where I need it at. Everything's looking good. Uh, I'm going to go and stick a fender out on this front end. And line this up. From here up. And we'll adjust that. And I'll put a few tacks in that and look at it. And take the door back off. And weld that bad boy in.
Alright, got the fender out here. Got the rocker set. I can still adjust it to where I want it to line it up with this, this right here, and up and down. And I'll go in there and spot weld. One little spot right in there to get it close all the way around. I'm gonna go ahead and weld it on in. Everything's looking pretty good. Let's see what happens. All right, let's take a look at what I've done here. Still got to finish welding it up, but it's in there. Had to do a cut here, a little work here, but other than that, fit in pretty good. Small cut there, a little work there, but it worked in. Well, I got to finish uh, grinding all the wheels down. We'll finish welding what holes you see here and grind everything down. But other than that, it went in pretty good. That's pretty good there. Come in tomorrow evening and finish that on off. Well, all right. All right, tank went dry on the welder last night, so got it filled back up. So we're ready to start welding again. Here we go. All right, let's take a look at what I've done. Got this side looking pretty good. Got it primed in for now until I get back on the body work. I guess I'll do a seam seal around this. And I'll start my cab corners. First of all, I'll go ahead and put the other rocker on the other side. Get it put on in. Then come back on these cab corners. So. Still got to weld, the, I mean, uh, grind the welds off the bottom on this side. Couldn't get to it right now. Didn't fool with grinding them down. Turned out pretty good for the first one that I've ever put on. So I'm going to go and hit the other side and come back, like I said, and hit them cab corners. So y'all take it easy.